In this video, we will test the jamming rate of the square nut, the sheet bend, the caric bend, and the uh, double fisherman's nut. So let's proceed and we will do the square nut. So left over right and right over left. So there you go. Then we will put a lock by a half inch and to the other side. Okay, there you go. That's the square nut. Now let's proceed to the sheet bend. And the two ropes must be of uh, different size in diameter so let's proceed there we form a bite then insert the other rope to the bite then go over under then across the bite and insert to the small smaller loop so there that's the sheet bend then we will lock it also with the half hitch just like this and there you go now let's proceed to the card bend so we have to form a V shape like this then we will put the other rope under the head of the fish shape then we'll go over and under and over then under just like this so we have this formation let's tight it up then there let's proceed to the double fisherman's nut and these two ropes should be in parallel then let's wrap this rope to the other rope so one turn then two turns then insert So the same with the other rope. One turn, then two turn, and insert. There. So I already seated up this uh, rope, anchor it on the bar, then here is the square nut and we have here a bowline in the bite. Now, what we will do here is to anchor these four metal plates to this bowline in a bite. Then we will drop it in order to 
have a high tension on these nuts and we will see it later if it will be jump or not so we will also do the same with the three other nuts later so now camera is in position and let's anchor the five pound uh, 20 pounds metal plate then drop it off There you go. So let's remove the metal plates and check the square nut if it jump or not. There you go. So I already removed the metal plates and let's see if this nut is this nut jump so here let's check it out we will just remove the lock and as i can see this nut the square nut tighten each other so it has the possibility to jump when holding the heavy load so let's try to untie it there we go one way of untying quick untying of square nut So the square nut jump. Now we have here the uh, sheet bend. We do the same, but first I will have to secure it with a half hitch. Okay. Camera is in position and I'm coring the metal plate. Here. Three, two, one. So there. Let's check it out. So the metal plate was removed. And let's check this nut. So let's see the result. Let's remove the lock of each and there just like the square nut it jumps a little so let's try to untie it we 
can just pinch this one there and there you go okay mm. now we have here the cardiac bend so let's put again the lock in here and another lock in here again ready for uncoring the metal plate 3, 2, 1 there you go Okay, let's check it if it jump. So the same with the other two lots. It jump a little but I think this bend is easily untied as compared to the other two nuts and last but not the least we have here the double fisherman's nut okay let's try to uncore the metal plate One. There we go. Let's ch let's check it out. So here is now the Duke Fisherman snap, and as I can feel, the nuts become hard and I think it was jump so I have I have to take time to untie this nut 